So the NDC youth organizer for the Swami constituency, Raza Kwampa, will spend the night here at the Sintresu Police Command. He was brought in by some executives of the NDC and detained by the police for inciting political violence in a viral video. NDC supporters gathered at the Ashanti Regional Police Command on Wednesday when the party's executives decided to bring the Swami Youth Organizer to the police. Police had launched a manhunt for Azak Kwampa for inciting political violence following some statements he made in a viral video. The party supporters followed up to the Suntresu District Police Command where the suspects was later moved to. In the company of his lawyer and both regional and some national NDC executives, Mr. Kompe's statement was taken and he was subsequently detained. So his statement has been taken and uh, caution statement and charge statement has also been taken. Uh, they charged him with offensive conduct and we were to go to court. But unfortunately, after the statement, we realized that uh, time has far been spent, so we agreed to go to court tomorrow. I must say and commend the original police command and the Sofulai police uh, service. They have put up a very good professional conduct. We must commend them. We would cooperate with the law. We are not perturbed about the detention of our brother here. No, he will be in South till tomorrow. He's not worried. We want to convey this message to our numerous supporters and DC people in Ashanti region that our brother, the youth organizer for Swami constituency, is in high spirits. In fact, he is rather encouraging us that we should leave him to be here because he meant what he said. He is not in any way perturbed about it but he has no intention of destabilizing the peace of this nation. NDC national organizer Joseph Yamin, flanked by other party executives and supporters, insists the NDC will not be intimidated by the arrest. We are not in any way going to be intimidated by the police and the arrest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Come on, come on. You see us must up here. We'll be coming any time the police takes an action. All we're expecting them to do is to extend equal measure to the MPP. They arrested, okay, we brought him because they intercepted a viral video. As I speak on my phone, I have four viral, I mean videos that will go viral any moment from now, from the MPP side. And we're expecting the IGP to issue a statement for the arrest of these MPP individuals. Yes. We are expecting it from tomorrow. Mm -hmm. If they can go after NDC people because they have intercepted viral videos, then they should be prepared to pick the MPP before we make a statement. But I'm very sure that tomorrow the court will have no, no powers to detain our brother because the court deals with precedents. Kennedy and Japan made a statement some time back and declared war in this country. The court said he had no locus, even a member of parliament, somebody who is vying to be a flag bearer of a political party. If the court says he has no locus, how much more a constituency youth organizer? And I thought that the police could stand on this and caution our brother and advise him. It is not always that the police should be arresting. The police is also there to educate and also to uh, advise. But here they took a stand, and I don't know why they want to do selective justice here. The Swami Constituency NDC Youth Organizer is expected in court on Thursday. Now, NDC supporters and executives say they remain solidly behind the youth organizer of the Swami Constituency in this matter. Hafiz Tijani, City News, Ashanti Region.